fans, this is going to be a short video on how to do pattern drawings. So definitely one of the more uh, at first difficult things to learn how to do, but once you get the hang of it, it's really simple. So patent, uh, all patent applications need to have at least one drawing if it's necessary, if it sounds ambiguous, it's on purpose, um, but it's good to include a drawing in your uh, application because it helps to illustrate the invention, the new thing that you've created. So the easiest way to do that, or the most straightforward, is with a flow model. So really simple, it can just be uh, three steps. Um, you just use a text box in Word, um, and then copy it two times. Uh, and the simplest way to do this is just to uh, have your inputs and then uh, your function or like whatever it is that happens and you can add an arbitrary number of steps if you want. Um, if your invention is three or four, you just um, add more. So like you want to do four steps, you can just add another box and another arrow, and there you go. Um, but we're gonna start with three steps. So say for uh, example, our first step, this is gonna be the inputs to our invention. So if you know, we're doing our time machine, we'll say a to stage rocket launching from Earth So here we have uh, three steps, right? So we have our two-stage rocket launching from Earth to geostationary orbit. We have our uh, rocket arriving at geostationary orbit. The stages separate. The second stage has an engine that ignites. Um, and then we have our output. So our second stage traveling toward the speed of light through a wormhole in space-time. Um, so then the next step is just to add uh, labels so um, same thing you can uh, you can do this in word um, oops messed that up so you just make a little uh, little swishies oops messed it up again uh, sorry about that guys There we go. Um, so just making little uh, swishy symbols, and um, then you're gonna add the uh, numbers to the uh, labels so that you can describe the uh, boxes in your uh, detailed description. So 
there's really no rules for how you number them, um, but uh, I just like to make, so if it's a figure one, I do 100. If it's a figure two, I start with 200. And then uh, going from there, uh, just going on up. So like starting at 100, going to 101. Other people do it differently. Uh, I've seen all kind of writing, but I, I like this because it's the most simple and straightforward. Um, So there you go. That's how you do patent drawings. Thanks for watching, fans, and have a great day.